The Knights of Seros and our most trusted allies have gathered. We have rallied our troops for the purpose of stopping the Adrestian Empire's efforts to rule all. We have prepared a new flag to fight under. Much like the Professor, it bears the Crest of Flames. I hope everyone finds this suitable. Beneath this flag, we will bring back peace to the great land of Fodlan. Professor, I am not sure I understand. Why is the Empire intent on making an enemy of the Church? What is meant by the way of the Church? What do they dislike about it? I have no idea what Edelgard was thinking or how she arrived at the decision to raise an army. However, I do have some small insight as to what she is after. She is attempting to destroy the existing social order. That is why the Church of Seros is first on her list of institutions that must be destroyed. It may very well be her goal to rebuild Fodlan from the ground up. I see. But that is only Edelgard's desire, is it not? I cannot imagine that the people of Fodlin would want that for themselves. She may have high ideals, but she certainly lacks any compunction about throwing the world and its people into an awful war. It just seems so illogical. You have a point, Flame. I do not believe the people will ever understand her aim. So long as she makes the people suffer, our Knights of Seros will fight on and strive to protect them. If we do not defeat Edelgard and retake control of this world, Fodlan's future shall be as dark as night. Thank you, dear brother. I finally feel I understand what is going on. I am always happy to answer your questions, Flame. Is there anything else you wish to ask? Well, um... Actually, I have a question for the Professor. My brother mentioned that you slumbered for five years. Where was it that you slept? Oh, well, I suppose one's first long slumber is difficult to recall. Pardon the intrusion, but we must prepare a counterattack, now! It seems the Imperial Army found out about us entering the monastery. Hmm, that is sooner than expected. They must have been spying on us. I wonder if we can win on our own. There aren't many of them. It looks like we'll just be facing the ones who were stationed nearby. Did they move on us too soon? Perhaps if we fight by using the land to our advantage... Of course, if we are careful, we will not lose. Never again will those Imperial scoundrels disgrace Garrig Mach with their presence. Onward, Professor! Welcome back one and all to Fire Emblem Three Houses. Wait, I am the Dark so Seraph. Though preparations War. are still being made to raise troops for the Resistance Army at Garrig Mach, the Imperial Army is already one step ahead. Anticipating the Resistance Army's actions, General Randolph and the Imperial Vanguard, under his command, begin their advance toward Garrig Mach to reclaim the monastery. Yeah. Wonder how this store is actually going to differ from the Blue Lions. Ignaz Leonian Seteth on support. Annette, I hate to tell you this, you're not strong enough. Of course, now there is flame, but I'll get her there. Wait. I can make her a bishop! Yay! Oh, 
Oh, I can only class down. Damn. These guys are mean. Watch out for them. I kind of want to bring Seteth into this. Lindar, you take a break. Ooh, no, I want Lindar. Sylvain, you can take a break. I'm going to bring in Seteth. However, you will be on her support. Just fine. You need to use that item, otherwise you're fine. weapon lance thing. You got this. The crest of keel. He does have a crest, but not the crest of keel. I don't... I don't know. So, said it, you won't be coming. So, Van, you're coming in after all. You're back to being on support. Hmm, yeah, said it. Wait. of Seros are a powerful enemy, but we have more soldiers. We'll take them down all at once. Clever tactics are our only hope here. We will use fire to deal with the main enemy force. Report. The enemy has entered the periphery of Garrig Mok. If we allow them to take the interior, the monastery will be lost. We must drive them back. I do this for all of us. Still here. What's my strategy? It's over. All is going to plan. I got cocky. Oh, amazing. I will prevail. I'll cut through. What's the plan? Ready for anything. More fighting. 
Put me in there. I'm awake. What? That strange... Father haunting me. Our troops are. Just be careful. Time for your last chance. This is my stage now. Oh, I'm low battery. Display. Time for pity. Good work. No, 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 no. Not for myself, for everyone. There's no turning back now. I'm getting... I'm not going down! You can open with a crit, man. Might makes right. Follow your example. War through. Come on, don't miss. Good shot. <laughs> A 
A boon for our future. Another victory. It won't be in vain. All is going to plan. Okay, that worked out. This is the cost of war. I'm... Seems simple. I will see this war through. Thank you. Both of you might as well get some experience. God, they keep coming. All is prepared. Now we just need to draw the enemy's attention. Traitors! Repent of your sins, and the goddess may yet show you mercy. Quiet! Don't think you'll get away with mocking me. Attack! Make sure they never speak again! Now, begin! Fire! It burns! See? Ugh, a fire attack. The damage is too great. We can't fight anymore. All units retreat. I'll take on our pursuers. Carry away the injured soldiers. Press the attack. No time for pity. There's that. All 
That really helped. Take it off. I'll fight to the very last. All is for victory! A boon for our future. Back to the fray. I'm great. All for our future. Nice work. Old hat. Nice work. Maybe I can make you that bow knight. Burn until we meet again. Ready for anything. If I live, I fight. I'll take all this... Won't be in vain. Damn it all! That's why I'm playing casual, I guess. To survive, I will win! Each battle a victory. 
An encouraging display. No openings? I'll make ah! it! Yeah! A lucky break. Not plugged in. Now I can plainly see that it is in fact plugged in. That's a fast. Strike him down. Crit's not necessary, but I appreciate it nonetheless. I could learn from that. How exciting. It was meant to be. Turn home like this. Watch out, Professor. They're coming for you. Okay. For my house. For justice. I will not be defeated. Whoa, please, my son. He says as he's defeated <laughs> immediately. Mother. I fight and grow stronger. Only natural. We face a powerful enemy today, but Garrig Mach will remain secure. drove back the Imperial Army. The real fight has only just begun. I never thought I'd be fighting Randolph. I guess it can't be helped, seeing as how I've left my own territory and all. But what will I do if my father or brother get involved? I really don't want to face them. Hmm. You must be strong. Too true, Professor. So long as the Empire is our enemy, we cannot avoid fighting those we are acquainted with. Though I suppose I have it easier, since my house is no longer on the Empire's side. My friends from the Opera said they would leave the capital and go west. So at least I won't be seeing them in battle. Hmm. I don't think I care if my own house falls. Let's make it a grand fight. After a grand nap, of course. It does course. not give me happiness to have the people of Bridget involved. But it is not the time to be thinking of that. If it is a possibility, I will be having their strength. I don't mind at all, really. I have no friends anyway, and my father hasn't done much to make me care for him. No Not kidding. That he'd ever step on a battlefield anyway. Oh, but I do wonder how Mother is doing. Each of our situations is unique. What we share is companionship, and the will to fight as one. Professor, you are the heart of our efforts. We will support you as best we can. I have a proposal. 
it would be most difficult to fight the Imperial Army with the forces we have now. As such, I believe we should send messengers to whatever lords we can trust in the Kingdom and the Alliance, so that we may gain their support. Do you agree? I agree. It is heartening to hear you say that. If all we do is bide our time, our enemy's main army will come down upon us like a hammer from above. Who are you planning to ask? Sadly, House Karen is out. We can trust them, but they have no help to offer. Hmm. How about House Daphne of the Alliance? Their leader is sure to at least respond. Judith, the hero of Daphne. Yes, that is a fine suggestion. That territory is on the border of the Kingdom and the Alliance. It has not yet been claimed by the fires of war. If they agree to lend us their troops, our forces will be greatly strengthened. We shall send along a secret messenger at once. I'm gonna end this one here. Thank you all for watching. You know the general shtick. Uh, anything important, I'll show you, but otherwise I'll do the around the monastery stuff in my own time. But until then, I am the Dark Seraph, signing off.